peacefulness of a nation. And all of those, you might say, are in vertical silos. What we did this year is we commissioned uh, a couple of um, PhD or a professor and a, and a doctor at uh, the University of Sydney to look at it horizontally. In other words, to look at all the data that exists in the model and try and find themes or factors, factor analysis, that run through the Global Peace Index that are statistically strong but are also somewhat independent of each other so that we can start to see what actually moves a country to become peaceful. And what we identified is three factors. Those are social, what we call social and political peace. Secondly is demilitarization. And thirdly, national security. Now, I unfortunately don't seek to try and summarize what goes into each one of those factors. They're all in the packs that you've got there in that, uh, in that document called Peace, uh, uh, Its Causes and Economic Value. Suffice to say that that is a completely different look at the GPI than just a ranking of countries. As I say, it's a horizontal evaluation of it and stands up to rigorous evaluation by statisticians externally. So the first one measures the degree to which nonviolent conflict can be resolved within a country. The second deals with troop deployments and casualties, what we would say is the more traditional measure of peace or violence. And the third is the capacity of a country for violence and perhaps more importantly, the resources opportunity cost, the opportunity cost of having resources deployed in those sorts of activities as opposed to others. And it's on that that the Economist for Peace and Security did further work. To move on, the, the drivers. We did a lot of work which sought to establish what the real drivers of peace were in the model that we'd created. And these six points of all of the drivers that we looked at, look, looked at were found to be the strongest, actually in priority order in terms of impact. So well-functioning government was by far the strongest driver of peacefulness 